actually did it. And we got a mom with nine puppies. Nine whole puppies. Here's the mom. <laughs> We're only a few days old and they haven't even opened their eyes yet. So we're gonna set aside a separate bedroom for them so they can have their own little place. Um, we're just gonna get to watch them grow over the next few weeks yeah. and uh, every week or so we're gonna take them to get their checkups and eventually their shots and stuff. And eventually spayed and neutered and then they'll find their forever homes. Mm -hmm. They had a bunch of puppies they took from, I don't know, the res, the res dogs. And basically there was a lot of moms that were pregnant or had babies or like other dogs that were gonna be taken to be put down in a high kill shelter. And I saw that post and I just felt it and we had to do it. So we got here, they had two pregnant moms, they had this mom with her nine babies. There was another mom who had like five babies, but she had like, she was very extremely protective of her babies. She was kind of, I just, we were worried about that because we have a dog already in Taquito. And then there was like a, two sets of three puppies that were a little bit bigger. But he was really called to taking this one. And it just, you know, I was like, whatever, we can do it. Potty break for the pretty girl. Potty break for the pretty girl. Come on, let's go back and see. Wait, I forgot something. I forgot these new lippies. <laughs> yeah, you're Kiji, you're such a good girl. She sees the treats and she automatically sits. Come on. Come on, come on. Come on, pretty girl. Back in with your babies. Look, there they are. There are your babies. Day three with these cuties. Go tend to your crying babies. Oh, oh, sorry. You're a good girl. Look, your babies are crying. Go, go tend to your babies here. Let's fix your blankets, cuz. Growling now. Oh my goodness, you guys are growling now. So I'm in here with the babies, with the puppies and mama. Because starting today, she's been taking out one specific puppy out of the pool that they're in. Um, she like starts crying when she does it, like she's crying a lot. 
and then just pulls it out of the pool, like the enclosed area. And so I just, I looked it up and I asked people in like dog groups that I'm a part of on Facebook. A lot of them saying that it could be like the runt, that maybe she's either not getting enough or she could sense something is wrong. But from what it seems like, the puppy seems fine, might not be eating enough. They're all, they all seem like, you know, healthy and fine. So we're kind of just going to keep an eye on them and um, continue to monitor, monitor that and see what like what's happening. It seems like she pulls it out to feed it on its own. So, you know, she wants to make sure that she's eating enough. <laughs> you like the camera? I think she's weaning her puppies now because she keeps getting away from them and here they are now walking around the room we actually have to create a better like pen situation for them but yesterday was a well technically I think we, we think she's been taking them out but technically it was the first night that we let them roam around, but we gotta, you know, we knew that they would mostly stay on this bed. So, we let them be out. And she's trying, every time they try to feed now, she gets away from them. So we think she's weaning them off now. And we had these training pads set up yesterday, nicely. <laughs> But they're not nicely set up anymore but it's crazy because oh 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 my goodness it's crazy because they're actually peeing on them and pooping on them i think mama still cleans up after them but they're literally peeing on the training pads this young that's crazy so that's good and there she is trying to avoid them and we set up that pool so that they don't go over there. And then sometimes it helps mama go in there and her food and water is in there. So today's officially three weeks since we got them. Puppies are three weeks old. Well, two days ago they were three weeks old. One month old puppies. Time flew by so fast, huh, pretty girl? <laughs> Look at you cute boy. Mm. Wait. So the babies have started walking around now. And just gonna say a few days ago, we bought this box so she could eat in here so they wouldn't get in. And this is what they do now. Let's get in and out. <laughs> also, they know how to use your training pads. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, pretty mama. I know. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. I wonder how 
All the training pads get all mixed up and bundled up. I do wonder. <laughs> oh my goodness, baby. Just set all those up. And there he goes. <laughs> we need to get you guys toys now. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so puppies are one week old now. And it's time for them to start eating puppy food. Well, they've been eating mush. And I captured that. So now we're going to mix puppy food with that human baby food mush. And so we're here picking up uh, Tractor Supply Co. The only place that sells it. Mm -hmm. The one that the foster uses, so. Or the, the one that the rescue uses, the food, so. Okay, so now we're inside and the puppies are also getting a lot more playful. Mm -hmm. So we're eating them toys now, so we're at looking at all the toys. I'm trying to decide what kind of toys they can play with because they're very small still. But they're getting playful. We don't want them girl, let me tell you, they're getting playful. <laughs> we don't want them eating what? Eating anything they shouldn't eat. Yeah, we don't want them getting into things they shouldn't. Like we had this basket where we kept mama's food and that basket had like a burlap material on the inside and they were like we don't know how but they kind of untied that <laughs> all and it was funny maybe something big like this <laughs> that makes like let's see one two three four five like five of them can fit playing with this <laughs> i can imagine how they're they're gonna react yeah that's too hot that's a good one these are some options here. Good options for little babies like them. <laughs> These are the toys we got them. Now we get the puppy food. Ready? Yep, look at that. So chill. Just no biggie. <laughs> look at the cute toys. Time to make the puppy mush in these puppy trays that we bought at Walmart. <laughs> and then we're gonna mix puppy food in this. Now you put this in the oven and you bake it at 400 degrees. Just kidding. So we got the baby food mush mixed with the puppy food. So here they are crying at the door. And uh, this is what's going to happen right now. <laughs> Let's help you. Let's help you. Let's help you. <laughs> Come on, let's help you. Let's help you. Come here, baby. Go. <laughs> Let me see the check. Yeah. Is that it? Oh. They're new toys. Look, babies. <laughs> you want it? <laughs> you need a bigger bone. 
scared Mama stole the baby toy. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> It's a good problem to have right here. Mm -hmm. <gasps>
Hi, baby. You got some shots? Did it hurt a little bit? This baby right here cried. Oh, no, it was this one. This one did pretty good, though. Yeah. No, Mama, no. No, your babies are up here. Your babies are up here. So I'm sitting in the backyard because I'm a little bit sad. Mama was just here, but she heard her babies crying. We just got back from getting the puppies their first shots. And one puppy, uh, there was people there, sorry. So there was people there that were like there for adoptions and stuff to adopt puppies. And so we had the puppies in the car in their kennels and people were looking at them. And I know that's the whole point, they're gonna get adopted. But it's just kind of sad, but also good because they're all gonna have homes and be happy and all that. One puppy, someone already signed up for one puppy to adopt them. That's, it's bittersweet, that's the word. It's bittersweet. But I love them. I love them so much. They're like my babies now. But that's the whole point of doing this. It's, it's to give them a second chance at life. To we save their lives. The rescue saved their lives. And fostering helps save more lives. And it's just, you know, that they're, they're going to be put down at a high kill shelter. And I was called to it, my heart was called to it. I know my heart is sad. My heart is sad. Because I have like two weeks left with them. We wanted to adopt Mama. We really wanted to adopt her. Like we had already like almost immediately when we got her I had decided to do that. And then just like Last week, I think, I don't remember when it was. We finally introduced her to Taquito because, like, I, we were putting it off for a little bit. I don't know why, but um, we finally introduced her, and they were not a good match. Like, it was just not, she was, like, so not happy to see him. And you know how dogs normally, like, when dogs are meeting each other for the first time, they wag their tails a little bit. Mama, come here. <laughs> come here, mama. They wag their tails for like a little bit or something like that. Mm -mm. She did not, she was not happy like at all. She growled at him. She was very, like her tail was standing up and we're like, okay, not a good sign. We didn't, we took them apart from each other. They were still in the same yard. And then we tried, he like approached her and like, she was like scratching or licking her paw or something and he approached her. I had him on the leash and James had him on the other, had her on the other leash. And she kind of like froze. She froze looking very angry that he approached her. And so I was like, unfortunately not a good match. You getting kid this? <laughs> Just a little black toe. A black toe. Mm -hmm. Oh, come here, mommy. Come here, mommy. baby. Come here. What are you doing? Mina, the babies. The babies, yo. Careful, careful. Careful, gentle, gentle, okay? Gentle. Gentle, gentle. I know, I know. <laughs> you won't stop giving me kisses. <laughs> Alright, so right now we're headed to the vet because Mama has like really bad skin stuff like this and this. Uh, I guess those right here. Please scratch me. 
<laughs> That's why I'm red. But <laughs> I'm sorry, Mama. I'm sorry. I'll keep scratching. Okay, so we're headed to the vet because Mama has a skin issue, and then this baby also has a skin issue right here on her tummy. So we're going to the vet. You waiting to see the doctor? Yeah. Here's a mama. Waiting. She was very quiet when the nurse was in here. <laughs> Mama's chilling now. Mama. 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 Come in. Come on, come on. You won't get hurt. You go open the door. You want to take mama for a walk? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. These two babies heard a dog barking in the distance and they got a little spooked. It's okay, babies. You stay. Now they're hiding with me. Oh my god. Oh, a ladybug. A ladybug? Oh my god, you got ladybug? Or pull my collar. Oh! Oh my goodness, baby. No, 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 no. No, no. <laughs> Alright, so tomorrow is adoption day. And um, like I mentioned previously, that was kind of like really unexpected. I mean, so soon. They kind of just told us like, two days ago that they were being posted online and all that so today's friday they told us that same night that they were gonna post them that night which came as a surprise to us five of them have meet and greets tomorrow and so we think that they're gonna get adopted i mean how could they not um and sad we have a project we want to do and i want to get all their paw prints with black paint i want to get all their paw prints with black paint on like a plank of wood yeah i'm gonna put every puppy and mama's paws on the plank of wood and that we got from a wood palette mm -hmm. get our way to remember them by yes yeah that way they have like their mark in our house, in our home forever. <sighs> it's sad. So fostering gonna... is awesome, but it's hard. It's you awesome. It is hard. So <laughs> he's about to um, sand the plank of wood. And then we're gonna like go upstairs, clean their room, and then let them all hang out outside again and then take their paw prints. All right, this is our plank of wood that we got. <laughs>
So, since it's adoption day tomorrow, we are gonna give the babies a bath again. And we just gave them one like a week ago? Yeah, a week ago. It was a week ago <laughs> when we gave them a bath, so we're gonna do it again. But, and we were gonna do mama, but we ran out of time. So now we're gonna do her first, and that's gonna be a struggle. <laughs> so, yeah, the babies getting their second bath ever. They're really quick. They're usually really quick because they're small, so, and some of them are like, they don't care. There's like two or three that were squirmy, but mm, they're pretty easy because they're pretty small to clean. So, yeah. Mama! Babies! <laughs> Who wants to go first? Who wants to go first? <laughs> Worried about his mama and being nosy and a little travieso. Trying to steal the breath. Oh.